Hello guys, hope you are all doing well. Welcome and welcome to this channel. Thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos. But in case it's your very first time, you're welcome. So if this is your very first time to watch this video, make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss on any videos. Alright, and also leave a comment let me know what you think about this video. So guys, in this video, I would like to just to about Nollywood actress Mary Unjoko. All you have to do is stay tuned and watch till end. Alright. Nollywood actress Mary Unjoko has lamented over the situation of things in the country. Taking it to our Instagram page last night, Mary Unjoko questioned if her fans were awake as she has been unable to sleep over the country's increasing problem. She also questioned how they were coping with the economic downturn. Mary Unjoku noted how there is scarcity of wealth, poor security, lack of cash flow and lots more. Who is awake? The problem in Nigeria is becoming unbearable. No money no flow, no security, nothing. How are we coping? The situation don't clear sleep from my eyes. This isn't the first time the founder of Rock Studios has been outspoken about the country's predicament. Recall that Mary Unjoku attacked the government while reacting to the disqualification of Super Ego from 2022 World Cup. The Super Eagles of Nigeria failed to qualify for the 2022 World Cup after drawing Ghana 1-1 on Tuesday night, March 29. In a post on her Instagram page, Mary Unjoku said she was thankful to God that the Super Eagles did not qualify for the 2022 World Cup. According to Mary Unjoku, Nigerians need to focus on the real problems in the country and the pressure of the government to do something. Referring to the attack on a train and the airport, Mary Unjoku added that Nigerians' insecurity was alarming and needed everyone's attention. content creator and founder of the Rock TV channels and CEO of Rock Studios, which she founded in 2013. With a catalog of over 3,000 hours of original content produced that includes movies and TV series, Rock has in a short span become a leading producer of family-friendly content and entertainment. Miri Unjoko has over
Enugu State. She attended Amungo Otofi High School, National College, Bagadao, and Navy Town Secondary School. She holds a diploma in Computer Science. From 2010, Mary Njoku attended Lagos State University, where she studied for a degree in English language. In 2012, Mary Njoku attended London Film Academy in the United Kingdom, founded by Mary Njoku produced the movie Mwanyoma, where her role required her to completely shave her head. Mary Njoku married British born Nigerian entrepreneur and African startup investor Jason Njoku in First Town, Lagos, on 18 August 2012, in front of family, friends, and colleagues. They welcomed their first son, Jason Obi. Rock Studios launched two new channels, Rock 2 and Rock 3, to meet growing demand of rock on DSTV. Rock 2 delivers content showcasing the origins of Nollywood, while Rock 3 showcases a variety of Ghanaian talent and has a music channel future in addition on the 24-hour movie and series selection. In 2019, Njoku oversaw the acquisition of Rock to Panel, the largest international deal to date for a Nollywood brand. Well guys, there you have it. Nollywood actress and Rock TV boss Mary Njoku has lamented over the situation of things in the country. While taking to our Instagram page last night, Mary Unjoku and the Rock TV boss question if her fans were awake as she has been unable to sleep over the country's increasing problems.
while taking to our Instagram page last night. Mary Unjoko question if her fans were awake as she has been unable to sleep over the country's increasing problem. She also questioned how they were coping with the economic downtown. She noted 